Quando Rondo just got arrested. Yeah, bro, charges. pulling up to my fucking party. Really? Man, bro. So tell me what happened. Man, a uh, dude came out there and say, Quando finna come fuck with you. Quando on the way up here to fuck you, with you. You fuck with Quando. He's one of your movies. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah, I fuck with Quando. And, uh, man, bro, this shit was like a, like a movie, bro. His couple of his, little, his partners pull up like, Quando finna pull up, woo the woo. We waiting on Quando to pull up. They like, the police got Quando down the street. Outside down the street. The feds taking them to jail. I was like, fuck. Man. I was like, fuck. I ain't, I ain't even get to see it, man. I, <laughs> and when we didn't hear about it, when we got to the uh, the other spot to eat, we like, this motherfucker might have been lying. Next morning I see it, bro. I mean, I, I've interviewed Kondo before. I, I like him, man. He's a cool kid. But it just seems like... <laughs> nigga funny, too, that nigga. He, he is funny. He is funny. <laughs> and he's talented. Yeah, that nigga. I, talented. I actually, I mean, matter of fact, that, that album he had with NBA Youngboy was one of my favorite NBA Youngboy projects, period. I thought the two of them just sounded great together. Yeah. You know? But but Kondo just seems to get into so much shit, it just doesn't make any damn sense considering how good he has it if you really think about it. Like, people really fuck with him. He really is talented. He's got a lot of big cosigns. Yeah. Like, you know, like, you fuck with him, I fuck with him. Like, I just don't understand why he's getting into so much trouble. I understand. You gotta leave them cities, bro. I mean, I don't know. I, I can't speak on Quan. I just know he remind me a lot of me when I was young. Yeah. You know, they can stay that's in that's trouble. That. Stay in trouble. Can't shake that motherfucker. Police don't like you. Like, that was, bro, all like, talented, you know, can act. This motherfucker killed my movie, bro. Like, he can act. Never been taught how to act. Like, too talented, bro. Like, I mean, and he funny, man. <laughs> My boy had to drive him home one night. He said, I can't, I can't see at night. I can't see. <laughs> bro, he said, I'm oh, serious. I can't see. Man, dude was stupid, bro. I got love for that little nigga, though. He, he make me smile, bro. Like, he remind me of staying in trouble. I used to do the same shit. I can't say nothing. Not back and forth out of jail. Yeah. Well, I mean, from what I understand, a lot of this stuff is happening from his hometown, and and you got to move move the hell up out of there. Yeah, go go get you a spot in Atlanta in L. A. Right, right, somewhere. It'd be a trap, man. Miami. It'd be there, a trap, there's, there's bro. There's lots of options for you. They don't be trying to help us. I mean, if you just got on paper for something else, why they didn't say we want you to go to uh, Virginia Heights? Yeah. Why they didn't say we want you go? We want you to go to a a ducked off place and. Gary, somewhere in Indiana, some motherfucking well. Like, come on, man. Like, long as you, bro, it's, it's, a, it's a recycling door, bro. You got to get away from that, bro. When I was looking at all the times, you know, I had to blame myself, but I was looking at my record one day and all my arrests in Baton Rouge hmm. over 10 years from 2000 to 2009. And I looked at all my arrests from Atlanta from 2015 to now. And I, I couldn't do nothing but shake my head, bro. I couldn't do, I couldn't do nothing but shake my head. 